And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. My name is Derek Ray, and with me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal fullback Lee Dixon. And Turkish Superliga action is what's on the menu today. This ought to be a thriller, Lee. Yeah, thank you, Derek. I'm really looking forward to this. Both teams certainly capable of producing some entertaining football. Hopefully we'll get that. Well, so much will likely go through Mesut Ozil. Lee, what sort of performance do you think you'll see from him? Well, you need legs around him, you need runners, but just give him the ball. When you've got that around him, he can turn a game on his own. Well, here is the lineup for the hosts today. An element of caution about this selection. Yeah, 4 5 1, Derek. The five players behind the lone striker will need to support him. Lots of very strong midfield offensively and also defensively. The back four will be protected throughout the game. Well, here's the starting 11 for Fenerbahce. And this is a formation most people in the game are very familiar with nowadays. Yeah, most coaches are adopting this formation. What it does give you is two holding players in front of the back four to protect them, but it also gives you three supporting players to that central striker. And so the match is underway. Davidson. Mubonj. Kolka. A very good tackle. And at Valencia. Valencia. Ozan Tufan. And it's with Osai Samuel. Well, the flag has gone up here. Offside it is. Manolis Siopis. Sosa. Helkas. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Dimitrios Pelkas. Jose Sosa has it. Looking for that final pass, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Oh, good save! And behind it's gone for a corner. <laughs> Taken short, and the goal kick will be next. Ozil in possession to give them the lead maybe superb save from the keeper well that's what you're paying for defenders defend goalkeepers make saves like that
Played into the centre of the box. Competent goalkeeping. Yeah, right place at the right time. Foils the attacker. So a throw in here. Well, it's been all Fenerbahce over the last 15 minutes. Their play really deserves a goal. But you don't always get what you deserve in this game. We know that, Derek. Well, possibilities inside the box. Great strong tackle. Throw in forthcoming. And he takes on the shot. And putting his body on the line. Could be a chance to break here. Not the pass he had in mind. All in all, a broken counter-attack. Ozan Tufan. Dangerous looking through ball. Cross towards that far post. Danger averted for now, but they have a corner to defend. Elects to go short. And a good looking ball. Clattered away. Now they're sitting ever deeper. Can he open them up here? Well, not testing the keeper at all with that effort. And they have possession again. Bright Osai Samuel. And it's a quality pass. Did look as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Kolker. It's with Siopis. Babakar. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Can he put them in front? Well, fantastic reflex action. Corner kick played in. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. The first half here comes to an end. Well, Mesut Ozil can dominate any game, but not particularly dominant on the basis of this performance, Lee. Yeah, movement, Derek, causes confusion amongst defenders. He's not done enough of that, as we can see. He's been The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Ozil. Nice looking pass. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in. Kolka. Francois Moubange. Manolis Siopis. Moubange. Well, that's not watertight defending. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Ozan Tufan. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent.
Over the touchline for a throw-in. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. Gukhan Gönül. Half an hour remaining then. Can they get in behind them? Alert defending. And the emphasis is on creativity. And players waiting at the far post. Goalkeeper's ball, the cross delivered too close to him. Well, they couldn't keep it. Can he give them the lead? Well, there is the opening goal. The pressure finally telling, and they get their due reward. Well, let's see that one again. It's all about the contact, does everything right. He's not bothered where the goal is. He knows where it is. He gets a beautiful strike on it. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. And they're making a change. The opening goal of the game then. Manolis Siopis. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. Ozil. Dimitrios Pelkas. Jose Sosa has it. Now they've lost it. Well, that's a super ball over the top. It needs an accurate cross. An attack full of promise. Offside, a tight one. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Luis Gustavo. This is Ozil. Ozil. Ball played nicely. Perotti. And they find a gap in the defence. This could be it! The goalkeeper and the referee has pointed to the spot at a crucial phase in the proceedings. A clear penalty and a yellow card to boot. Well, here it is again, and a good penalty for me is one that just hits the back of the net. Left, right, down the middle, just find the goal.
It's going their way, 2-0. Chehun Gulsalam. They might be able to get in now. And that's easy peasy for the keeper. Well, getting the ball forward. Efejan Karaja. Teammates in the middle. And a harmless cross gobbled up. Babacar couldn't hang on to it and that is the end of the game it goes into the history books as a home defeat Lee your thoughts yeah they really struggled to get to grips with this game to be honest starts in midfield for me always seems second to the ball and then too many mistakes at the back has cost them poor performance overall and the final analysis a really positive performance from this man Lee well, he never gave that back line a chance to get a breath. Two goals for the lad today. Played superbly well, looked really sharp, constantly playing on the shoulder of the last defender. A real.